Well, hello, 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 my mad scrappers. No, this is not a mail call. Ha, psych, fooled you. Actually, believe it or not, this is the mad scrapper filled another jumbo jet thousand, th thousand subscriber giveaway. Yay! I bet you thought you didn't expect me to start from here, huh? I'm supposed to be actually on my headset talking from the computer. I'm right next to the computer at my desk. Why do you say, why, why, why is she doing this? You know, why is she sitting here with the package under her hands, right? Well, let's see. Guilt is the driving force in my life in oh so many ways. And I, I really, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I really felt really, really bad about having to um, reschedule the reveal for yesterday. So I put it in my mind that, you know what, I'm gonna make it up to them. So here is making it up to you. I have added a prize to all the prizes being given out because I, it, I now feel so much better about having counsel. Let me just say it. And for so many of you who have asked and who have prayed and, and, and given me such words of encouragement, guys, you just floored me. I mean, just floored me. I, I can't even begin to um, tell you how much it is meant to me and how much I appreciate all that, 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 the prayers and the love and, and the understanding, seriously, it made me feel better. And yes, it was, a, it was, it was a, not a, I, I don't even know how to say it. I mean, she was not as well as apparently my sister saw her. So she was struggling a little bit more today, it seemed like to me, but I was able to sit and talk with her and explain and help her with her problem. My problem is that my mother's having me, uh, she has health issues and she's gone down the rabbit hole of, of depression and anxiety to the point where it's affecting her health. So hence why she's in the locked unit. Um, and and, and I, I, I thought I wasn't getting to her and I talked to the nurse and, and I, I now find myself talking to nurses twice a day. I call all the nurses and make sure that they understand how my mother speaks so they can so I can help her get the care that she needs. So it's you know, it's a thing. I have to call, you know, twice a day. But um I called the nurse, the night shift nurse after shift change, to talk to her after the visit a little a little while ago. And she said that my mom actually did a lot better, that that she wasn't in pain, that she and, and her pain means that she doesn't have the anxiety because the anxiety is what is driving and causing her really just un was causing unrelenting abdominal pain and just pushing her off the edge. Um, and, 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 and she was better and she sat in red and she made her bed and she straightened out her clothes. I mean, all these things that she wasn't doing. And so she said, she's gone to sleep and she said, did you need something for pain? And she says, no, I'm, I'm, I'm thinking maybe I, I may have reached a little bit of her and to ask for insight, somebody who's 87 is tough. So, and I'm sorry, I'm prattling here like you guys care. So I'm going to let that go. I'm going to thank you guys for the prayers. I believe we're making slow but steady progress. And it's just going to be a thing. We're taking in a turn. Everybody, somebody goes every day so that she, we see her, so that she knows that her family cares for her. And no, we are not. Because she thought, she was talking to me like, today, like, oh, no, I'm, I don't, I'm never getting out of here. And I go, yes, you are, Mom. We have not locked you up and thrown away the key. You're not staying here forever. We just need to get this under control and, and work with the program a little bit. And you'll be home. So I think I may have reached her. Cross your fingers, guys. Keep the prayers coming. Please pray for my mom. I, I, and, and for us as a family, I really, really appreciate it. So let me let that go because then I'll get, I'll get myself all sad and anxious myself. So, um, I wanted to, again, because I had to cancel, I felt really bad. So I wanted to add an extra prize. So before I award all the prizes, I'm going to tell you what the prize is. Yay. So here's the bonus prize. So we're going to start from back to front. So this is, again, one of those things where if ordering one is great, apparently ordering two is better, right? So it's another duplicate prize. And this is from, gosh, I've had this for probably a year. It's been hanging around. This is from before I moved. So it's it's gone all over creation. So it's the um, Gemini. It's the hydrangea cutting the dyes to cut the flowers and the flower form. So I have a set for myself. So it comes with the, the, the white paper for the hydrangeas, and then you get this really, really pale sage for the leaves. So it comes with the, the, the foam, and I have the dyes. 
if you search for just, you know, gem, I mean, if you look up hydrangea flower, fl crafters companion hydrangea um, flower forms, you will probably find videos on how to work this, but I need to do one. I have a bunch of these because they're just like, <gasps> they've really caught my fancy. So, you know, without with spring cards coming in after Valentine's, shoot, even with Valentine's, I could do a card. So I will do a tutorial on this, but you can find a ton of them online. Now, what else have I got here in my little handy dandy envelope of tricks? Um, I thought, you know what? I, I do a little bit of Valentine theming here. So I added this because I just recently bought this. I bought this with the, not the January craft day, but the laugh crazy, cra laugh crazy uh, craft day. And I had this, but because I don't have everything inventory because I couldn't find my Valentine box because it was in storage, um, I duplicated it. So again, my duplicate means somebody gets this. So it's this lovely heart die from Gemini. And, I, and I'm telling you, I liked it. I liked it enough to buy it twice, guys. So you're, this is not like, oh, I'll just get this and throw it in. No, 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 no. I bought this because I, yours truly here, I wanted it. She just didn't realize she had it. Um, this is another one I've had for a while. You can tell just by the packaging. And I love these edible dies, and I just never got around to using it. So when I went through recently my bins, and again, when I start inventorying Crafter's Companion, I suspect that I'll be purging some more. I had to be real with myself. And I go, I have had this for a while. I haven't even so much as opened the package. Really? I think it needs to go to a new home who will love it and hug it and call it George. So here you go, guys. Here is an edgeable dye opal edge from Crafter's Companion. And then last but not least, again, back to the Valentine theme, is the Happy Valentine's Day from Simon Says. Because, again, I liked it so much that I didn't buy it once. I bought it twice. Actually, I think I bought it three times. But I can only find two of them. So maybe I'm crazy. Actually, no, 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 no. It's not a maybe. I am. But I got this one. And it's, I don't want even to open it. But let me see. Let me see if I can get at the one I have. Hang on a second so you guys can see it. Hold on. I have returned. I found it. Boy, did I do had to do some serious digging. I really need to organize all that Valentine stuff because it barely fits in the container it's in, which tells me I need a bigger container. We. So anyway, this is mine. So it's just one, just one single die, and I and I think it's all together. Is it not? Yeah, it's kind. Of, but it might not be the easiest one to put together. And I, there you go. But I really, really loved it. So again. Because I thought it was a great idea to have it. I didn't buy one. I bought two. And now one of you guys is going to win this. So this is the bonus prize that we have for the um, for my giveaway. So that's it. Thanks a lot. I will be right back in a minute because now I'm going to switch over to the computer. And we're going to draw the prize winners. Yay! Be right back. Okay, I lied. I forgot. I cannot remember if I mentioned this. In the prior video, and I'm not, I'm going to mention it again. I have a grip of these. I'm going to clean these up. These are all ones that Steve has brought home for me, but these are the handy dandy, totally awesome box package opening tools from Amazon that he has. So I'm going to, everybody that gets a prize is going to get one of these in their prize boxes because these things are awesome. You guys have seen me open up pads of paper. These are the bomb, flat out. For opening your pads of paper so you don't tear your paper or mess up trying to get the tape off. All right. So everybody gets one of these. So I will clean them up and make them pretty. I haven't had a chance to do it, but now I got it. Okay. Cause he's got to go out in the mail the next day or two. So I'll be now I'll be right back. All right. Well, all righty, my mad scrappy friends. I am back. We are now looking at the main screen of the original giveaway. I just wanted to review some rules just to be safe with YouTube. I mean, you guys already know the prizes, but I will show them to you again. The first one, number one is Spellbinders December 2022 Glimmer and Cut Value Club. Uh, number two, and it, it comes with the bonus adhesive. Since I got two of them and one of them, I just spread them. So one of them will have the, um, the dots and the other one will have the tape runner. Um, number two, the Spellbinders January 2023 Glimmer and Cut Value Club. Number three is the Fun Stampers Journey Loaded Bloom Box with three card kits, stamps, and instructions. Number four is the, the excuse me the Fun Stampers Journey Loaded Bloom Box with two card kits, stamps, and instructions, and Simon Says Stamp 
orchid rose bouquet stamp and two mementos cut in embossed dies. Number, that was just number four, right? So number five, that's the mad box, including the Sizzix die brush and pick tool, the Tim Holtz Gothic tapestry stamp, the diamond press edge borders and dies, and diamond press pop-up Easter basket card kit. And number six, which is not listed here, but you know what? Let's add it in now. So number six is going to be bonus prize. Oops, let me put a beard there. Bonus prize. And that's going to be the crafter's companion. And I'm dragging this out so we can sit here and chat, guys. So that's, that's the whole reason behind doing this. So crafter's companion, um, fl hydrangea flower form, flower form, foam, and dies. The crafter's companion edgeable die, edgeable die. And are you, is, is the suspense killing you? Would you wish this was not my genius idea? Of course you are. Don't lie to me. And what else was in there? I already forgot. Criminy. I have to look at the bag, which is now buried underneath all the prizes because I already forgot what else did I put in there. What else did I put in there? Let's see. Let's see. Oh, yeah. The Simon says, Happy Valentine's Day, si die. So Simon says, Stamp, Happy Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day die. Oh my god, I can't type. And the Crafter's Companion heart. Um, what is this called here? It says heart, and it is a paper craft die, really. A swing card. Okay, so and Crafter's Companion. Curse, my goodness. Okay, heart. Swing card die. Okay, so those are our six prizes, guys. So I don't need to review the rest of it. You guys already know how to enter because you did. The You already know that this was free. It was open for five days. It already closed down on Sundays. So I will review the rest of the reviews just to make sure I, I'm okay with, face, with Facebook. Why do I want to say Facebook? YouTube. Okay, so the winners are going to be chosen randomly using random.org. Okay, it, we will be, this is going to be previewed. I'm doing the reviews now, the reveals now, and we all are going to sit here and watch it as a premiere on tomorrow, February 1st at 6 p.m. Same bat time, just a, well, same bat channel, different bat day, but same bat time. The winners will be announced in the description box of this video as well as on the on the premiere video. So we're going to change that now and we're going to type in premiere. Premiere. Oh my goodness, really? Okay, the premiere video on and let's change that too because it is not longer January 1st. It's not going to be February. February 1, 2023. Winners, this remains unchanged. The winners must, con must contact me at themadscrapper gmail.com. Please write in the subject line, winner. This may be, it'll make it easier for me to see and find you. I mean, you can put winner, winner, chicken dinner. I don't care. Just mark it big and bold. Um, winners must contact me by February 5th, 2023, or winners will be disqualified. This giveaway is not associated or affiliated with YouTube. Any number nine, any information collected from this giveaway will be used for the sole purpose of delivering the prize to the winter. And I already have a spreadsheet. I have it broken out in two in Google Docs. So one of them shows me the addresses and emails on how to contact you guys. But the one that you'll be seeing on screen in a minute is stripped of all and just shows only names. Um, number 10, this giveaway complies with the YouTube community guidelines and entries that do not comply. Excuse me. And entries that do not comply will be disqualified. Um, number 11, this giveaway is not associated or affiliated with YouTube. YouTube is not a sponsor of this giveaway. So if I had to say it once, repeating it ain't bad. Um, number 12, by participating in this giveaway, you release YouTube from any liability directly related to this giveaway. The buck stops with me, people. If anybody is unhappy, they can contact me and feel free to yell at me. I have thick skin. <coughs> excuse me, 13, <coughs> excuse me, I am solely responsible for this giveaway and delivery of the prizes to the winners. All right. So guys, without further ado, what do you think? Shall we get cracking on doing this giveaway? 
I guess so. So I'm just letting you guys know when I pull the prizes, I have my trusty Sharpie pen right here. Every one of these prizes has a sticky on it that says what it is. So I'm right now putting the dies back in the bonus prize. So I have a sticky on it that says bonus. And what I'm going to do as I pull them, I'm going to grab my trusty little Sharpie and I'm going to put your name on that sticky as a fail safe. Okay, guys, so that'll be just one more way to identify them and then I'll get ready for them to be mailed and I need to hear back from you. I ha I will be mailing them out on the 5th. What day is the 5th? I didn't even think about that. Let's see. What day is the 5th? The 5th is Sunday. So that means on Monday I'm heading to the post office with the prizes. Okay, guys? So make sure you get a hold of me by Sunday, please. I want to give these things away. And you guys want them. I know it. So be with it, all right? Okay, guys, so let's go over, and so let me just really quick show you. So here's our spreadsheet with all the names. So we had 44, excuse me, 42 entrants for this giveaway. Yay! I'm so excited. Woo! -hoo! So we are now, so we're now going to go over to random.org, and that's my next tab over. And you're going to see here to the right where I'm drawing my little, my little circle with my little arrow, the random number excuse me, true random number generator. So the minimum is one and the maximum for us is 42, which is the life, the answer to life and everything in it. Bonus points, if somebody could tell me in the comments where that came from. All right, let's see how deep your geek goes. So, okay, without further ado, hang on, let me grab prize number one and not make a mess of things so that I can grab it I drag out a little bit of time. I knocked something off the desk. I'm not sure what it was. And I have my little Sharpie, my little prize. So let's generate us a winner. Click. Woo. Okay. So the winner is number 13, Lucky 13. Who are you, Lucky 13? That is Brenda Gomez. Yay! Everybody, congratulate Brenda Gomez. You have won the December 22 Glimmer and Cut from Spellbinders Prize. Brenda, do not forget, get a hold of me, all right? Email me, all righty? So I scribbled your name on the sticky. The sticky now has your name on it. All righty, guys. So let's move on to number two. All righty. So where's my mouse? There's my mouse. All righty, so one more time, we're going to do the same thing. Minimum, maximum, 42, nothing has changed. We are now going to generate our number two prize winner and click. And number 14, really? How random is that? That's just plain silly. Are we just doing the lottery while we're at two? But that's the one that won. So let's see, number 14, who are you? Judy Mannion. Yay! Yay, Judy. Congratulations. You have won the number two prize, which is the January, the Spellbinders January Glimmer and Cut. You're gonna, and if you want to see what you won, just watch the video, okay? So, Judy, let me write your name on this lovely sticky. Mannion. Okay, let me make sure I spell it right. Okay, there we go. So, guys, two winners down, but four to go because, remember, now we have a bonus prize because I'm a guilty body. Okay, so let's move on, and we will see who is number three. Let me see where my boxes are. There they are. Okay, I now grabbed number three, which is the bloom with three card, the bloom box with the three cards. So let's go back to random.org, and I want you to see it. This is the way it's going on I mean, for me live, not for you, but I wanted everything to be visible so you guys see what you know exactly how the winners are being generated so let's click on generator one more time and that number one all righty all right so let's see who number one sharon pimento yay sharon congratulations you won the bloom box Woohoo! so let me put your name on this box and let me spell it correctly all righty Sharon congratulations don't forget email me let me know that yay you're all excited to get your prize okay and something I'm oh wait a minute I, I need to tell my my moderator that she needs to give me editing privileges to my own document 
because I was going to highlight them in color, but I can do that afterwards. I will tell her because we weren't going to talk about how late at night I'm doing this because I've just been crazy busy. All righty then. So now let's go and we're going to go for prize number four. So let's go back to our friend random.org and we're just going to inch and inch and inch and circle it once, circle it twice, circle it three times just for luck. And let's hit generate. And now it's number eight. All righty, let's go for lucky eight. And who is number eight? Dieta Morris. Woo! All right, actually, it's Dieta. Dieta, yay! Congratulations, you are the winner of the num of the bloom box with the extra stamp and dies. So now let me make sure I I I, I get her name spelled correctly. All right. Okay. So guys, one prize left. The last one, the bonus. Actually, no, what am I talking about? Guys, remember, I can spell. I'm basically crafty, but don't ever ask me to count. Just just saying. This is why we need gener these random generators and all these things to do with things for me because numbers and I, we don't get along. Okay? We have a passing, you know, tense, you know, relationship. <laughs> All right, guys, so let's go for prize number five. We still have one more left after this one. So, and this is the miscellaneous box of madness. It's got the 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 Sizzix brush tool and the Tim Holtz die and all that. And guys, keep an eye out because I have a, a special treat for you. Whoever wins this prize is going to get the brush with the magnet already put on it so you'll get the packaging but i'm pulling the ma the brush and the magnet out so that because um peanut gallery is going to come on on a video so he's going to be our guest our guest instructor because i want to do a video about how to flip to put the magnet on because he got it on for me in like five minutes i sat there i, I can't tell you how long i took me fiddly farting and i gave up and i said can you see figure out how to put this on and like in five minutes, he had it on. So he has, he figured out the science to it, and I want him to demo it for you. Okay, guys? So anyway, now that I've dragged out the suspense a little bit longer, we're going to go one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight. And I did that because that was what Djokovic was doing. That's how many times he would bounce the ball before he would serve. Uh, yes, we watch tennis. All right, guys. So let's click on our generate. Who's next? Oh, we number eight already won. Number eight, you cannot win again. Love you, Dieta, Dieta, but no, I'm sorry. One prize per person, right? Because that's it. Nope. How random is that? Okay, we're going to have to talk to this thing. So you know what? What I'm going to do, give me a second. Let's just be fair. I'm going to refresh the page. Okay, so we're going to do this again. We're going to go to 42. So let me enter 42. Maybe I should have done that with each time, but we're not going back. It's staying how it's staying. So we're back to number one through 42. We are going to generate one more time. And it is 23. Woohoo! All right, 23. Who's number 23? That's not what I want. Good grief. You guys don't care about what I'm editing. Um, and our winner is Dana Crawford. Yay! Yay, Dana. I'm hoping I'm saying that right, and it is Dana. And I should have been writing these people's numbers down, but I can find them. So, Dana, you have a box with your name on it. So, make sure you email me with the heading that says, Winner, dinner, chicken dinner. I want my prize. All righty. But there we go, guys. So, we're down to the last prize, the bonus guilt prize. Because I have a very guilty conscience. What can I say? So, we're going to come over here to random.org. And I'm going to do it again. So, I'm going to refresh this page. There we go. I'm going to click. I'm going to go in here and input 42 because that's how many entries we have. And we're going to go. We're going to do the Djokovic, okay? So one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight and nine and ten. Because Pina Gower told me, no, he bounces it sometimes eight, sometimes ten. So now we're covering both of them, okay? So we gave you guys the Djokovic luck. All right, let's see. It worked for him. Dude won the, the U.S. Open. Excuse me, the U.S. Open. The Australian Open. So let's see. Let's click that generate one last time. And our winner is number 37. All righty. See, sometimes bet the latecomers get a prize. 
So number 37, who are you? Number 37, Annette King. Yay, Annette, you won. You won the bonus prize. See, your luck was in because I would, originally this wasn't going to be in here. So, and, and, and because of guilt, you get a prize. So, Annette, again, do not forget, give, shoot me an email. Let me know. You saw this because I want to get you your prize. Guys, thank you, thank you, thank you so much for hanging out with me for this. Congratulations to all the winners. I have stuff for you. And everybody also gets one of our little handy dandy little gadget little little um amazon little oh, box openers but i use them strictly for to open the pads well you've seen me open packages too but they're great to open pads and i've had yet to toss one out because they got because they did not you know they've gotten on sharp so there's a lot of life to them but i'll clean them up for you and ship those off to you as well with your prizes so um guys thank you I can't, I mean, from the bottom of my butt, because my butt is bigger than my heart, um, I, for hanging out with me, for all of the lovely notes, for all of the views, for the subscriptions, for helping me grow this channel. It, you know, I am not the, by, by far, I am not the biggest. I'm just this little tiny pipsqueak channel that does this for fun, and, um, I, I, and I just do it. I do it for the sheer joy of this. So sometimes I, you know, when life takes over, life takes over. And, and I've had a little bit of that again. And even then you guys have come out and lifted me and, 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 and I feel so undeserving and, and so eternally grateful. Cause I just do this because I'm crazy and told, nobody told me that I couldn't. <laughs> right. So I'm going to thank you and I'm going to let you go. I've stayed on here for, I mean, not long enough by a long shot, but know that I'm going to work on the two camera system. I really want to, and I just, I'm, I'm slow on technology. I got to that age where I think I need my children to explain things for me. Oh, Lordy. But I want to be able to, so that I can see, or you guys can see me, but I'm going to start doing lives soon. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do, whether I'm going to be doing cards soon, or I might start working on some like mini albums. I love mini albums. I haven't made one in far too freaking long. So we're going to see what Myra, you know, the Mad Scrapper here is going to come up for Mad Hour. So um, I will keep you posted. All right, guys. So meanwhile, again, thank you so much for entering. Thank you. Congratulations to all the winners. I would say if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. But I better see at least three, six thumbs up because the winners better like this video, <laughs> okay? <laughs> but if I, either of you guys want to, by all means, if you want to drop me a comment, go ahead. I'm, I'm pretty much keeping up with the comments again, you know, hit and miss, but I'm getting them done. And um, if you want to see more of this madness, I'll be back. I mean, I don't know. I have a birthday coming up in July, so maybe we'll do another, you know, it's my birthday and you guys get the presents. So we will see. So I let let let's keep it rolling. I you know I feel blessed, so I feel like I should pay it forward periodically. So I'm on that note, guys. I am going to let you go. Have a wonderful, wonderful evening. Um, I will see you at the next one. Craft something beautiful. And meanwhile, don't ever forget, we are all a little mad here, peeps, including this crazy mad scrapper here. So come on, let's craft the madness together, okay? I'm going to talk to you guys later. Bye!